morning, everybody. Happy Sunday. And speaking of Sunday, next Sunday is my birthday. Yay! So, without further ado, I'm going to show you off all my Disney shirts that I have. And that still fit me. <laughs> um, okay, the one that I'm wearing right now is a Minnie Mouse one. It's like, I don't know if you can tell, but like, the, the, there's little hearts making up her bow. The red part is like all these hearts. As are the... As are the gray parts. So I got this from the Disney store in the Del Amo Mall, and it was, I'd like to say it was 1995. Um, yeah, so it was one of my favorites. I just got this one. My lovely grandma got it for me, so thank you, Grandma. Okay. And once that's settled, I'm but wait, there's more. Okay, so I got this one basically for my Disneyland trip in um, I got this one for my Disneyland trip, when I, Disney California Outdoor trip I took in April. I wore this for Frozen Fun. It's Olaf, of course, because, and this one's a Disney store, I got it in the one in Santa Monica. But it was like, I think it was like on sale, I feel like. Well, now it's on sale. Now it's on sale for like nine ninety nine at the Disney store, but you, they still have it. I mean, I don't know. And it says, I'd melt for you. I don't know if you can see that, but it says, I'd melt for you. Because it's true, he's Olaf. Okay. Next shirt, well, it's a tank top mostly because it I wore this last summer. It's the Cheshire Cat, like looking all Cheshire Catty. This is the scene where he's like tipping his ears to Alice, I think, and he's like a Cheshire Cat. But um, I think I got, no, I got this at Hot Topic for like twenty two fifty, I'd like to say. I don't know. It was like a year ago, so I think it was like when they were having that bogo bounty going half off sale, I think, or was it all tank tops? I don't even remember now, but anyways, if you're wondering my sizing, yes, this is a large. It's like, you know, I'm a large Marge. And the words of Winnie the Pooh, I'm short, fat, and proud of that. It's true. And then, this I'm telling you, does not fit me, but I still have it. Toy Story. I got, I think I wore this on my Alaska cruise because, hey, Alaska's cold, you might as well just wear something like thermal. It has the Toy Story gang, the Ham, Jesse, Woody, Buzz, Rex, and the little green alien. This is Toy Story. I got this I think from Forever 21. It looks Forever 21-ish, so I'm going to say Forever 21. And I don't remember how much it retail for, but it was really cheap because Forever 21 was really cheap, which is a good thing. What I find about Forever 21, just like offhand about it, is just that like when they fit me, the stuff, the sizing is really weird there. And their quality is ridiculous. At least to me. My mom and I both think it's ridiculous. But the quality of the clothing. Like, it, sometimes I find frays in the clothing. Like, if I try it on, you know, sometimes. And it's, like, cheap, which is good. But then again, cheap could also be a bad thing. Okay, moving on. Sorry, I had to do a rant. Um, okay, this one is a muscle tank. I've never worn muscle tanks, but this one was perfect enough, so that my, you know, thing wasn't showing. It's basically the scene where Ariel it finds the dingle hop basically finds the dingle hopper for Flounder, I, I think. I'm not sure, but I think this is when they get eaten by the shark. I never saw Little I think I saw Little Mermaid, but I just don't know. Like what order the movie is. I think I saw it out of order. I don't know. Okay. And then this is the boat on the back. Like it has like the boat on the back because why not? Also, I'm not gonna get into it, but there is a Disney conspiracy theory involving the boat. Just letting you guys know. If you know it, thank you. If you don't, whatever. Look it up. Next shirt is... The shirt's getting a little small on me, honestly. I just bought this and, like, it just got small on me. I don't know. It might be cotton. Um, this one is an Alice in Wonderland shirt. It has all of them. It's, this is why I like this shirt, because it's Alice in Wonderland. I love this movie. The Mad Hatter, the March Hare, Alice, the White Rabbit, Cheshire Cat, and the Dormouse. Like, really, the only shirt that I could find with the Dormouse on it, really. Because the Dormouse is so stinking adorable. I got this one, I think, with my other shirt, but I won't get on 50% off, so I think this one was like... <laughs> I don't remember, but this was from the Disney store, and so, yeah. They might still have the shirt at the Disney store, I'm pretty sure they still do, but... If you want to get it, just go to the Disney store. I got that one at the Sherman Oaks Disney store, so... Okay. The creme de la creme. Um, my Frozen shirt. I'm going to wear this to Disneyland on my birthday, which is still on 18th, just letting you know. 
It's just as it's just as on and off on it says family forever, which is true because I believe in that. This retailed I stole the tags on it for nineteen ninety five. And it's from the Disney store. Really good quality. Yeah. This was on sale, so I decided to get it. It's Daisy Duck. My friend Roxy has the same one, so we'd be twinning. Roxy, if you're watching this, you're awesome. Um, so it says Daisy Duck on it. And it was reduced from nineteen ninety five to nine ninety nine, so I think it's a pretty good deal. I think it was during the twice upon a year sale that I got this. So yeah, it's a really, it's a really nice shirt. I still have yet to wear it though. Okay, this one is like really one of my favorites. I just love this one. I got this at Uniqlo, this really weird Japanese store. It's pop art Andy Warhol Mickey. What do you expect? It's like really cool. You know, if you don't know who Andy Warhol is, look him up. Anyways, Mickey and pop art is like the best. I I'm like a very artsy person, so I believe in like pop art surrealism. You know. <coughs> I don't draw, but I do trace things like it's just like I don't do things freeform. But anyways, my drawing looks my drawings look good. When I trace them, it's really good. And then coming out of the wire, we have I got this a wet seal for some because wet seal is now out of business. I'm assuming so. Hipster Tinkerbell. It's a crop. It's a crop. It's a crop um, sweater, but I wear a tank top underneath it because I cannot pull off the crop look. But it's Tinkerbell as a hipster because why not? You can have Tinkerbell as a hipster and be cool as the heck. And, and if you notice, the ne the theme of this is Tinkerbell, so I'm like a whole pink person, just saying. Yet I can never do my hair in the Tinkerbell top knot. It's like I'm horrible the top knot. Okay. Uh, this one is a Tinkerbell, which I thought looked. That was the one that I got with the Alice Wonderland one, which was like buy one get fifty percent off. So. This one says Forever Pixie because I I literally wore this yesterday at BeautyCon, so. And for, if you all went to BeautyCon that are watching this, I met Candy Johnson. Candy Johnson, you're awesome. Okay, last but not least is this. Is this. Um, Minnie Mouse Pullover. I think I got this from 21. It's like Minnie, Minnie's face, you know, like there's rhinestones on her bow, I think. Like there's, yeah, there's rhinestones on her bow. I got this from Forever 21. It's like, I'm pretty sure it's a medium, but I'm not 100% sure, because I don't even know what the sizing is of this. I, there's like no size on this. Okay, that's really weird. Anyways, I mean, I don't think this fits me anymore, but I still have it just in case if I start to lose some pounds. But okay, yeah, that's it. So anyways, um, I'm going to Disneyland. Okay, okay. I'm going to update you with my Disney year. On July 19th, I'm going to Disneyland for the day, and it's probably going to be crowded because of Disneyland's birthday being two days prior, and it's a weekend, so you might not, you might as well, I mean, I might as well be going and be crowded, you know, and, um, also, <coughs> sorry, oh. um, also I'm going to the D23 convention, I'm going to the Saturday of the convention, I'll be dressed as Hipster Ariel, and be sure to look for me there. And, um, oh yeah, September 30th to October 5th, I'm going to Disney World. I'll probably be there for the Halloween party and food and wine festival, so we're going towards, we're going, like, during my mom's birthday, so she really wanted to go to the food and wine festival, so, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's pretty much it for my updates. Um, please feel free to like, subscribe, comment, thumbs up, tell a friend, blah, peace out, Girl Scout.